क्वेश्चन इज गिवन स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ फिफ्टी प्लस स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ टेन डिवाइडेड बाई स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ फिफ्टी माइनस स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ टेन सो वी हैव टू फाइंड आउट द वैल्यू ऑफ दिस वन लेट्स सी सोल्यूशन स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ फिफ्टी प्लस स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ टेन डिवाइडेड बाई स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ फिफ्टी माइनस स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ टेन सो वी कैन डू हेयर वन थिंग वी कैन मल्टीप्लाई विथ कॉन्जुगेट पेयर ऑफ डिनोमिनेटर सो वी कैन मल्टीप्लाई बोथ साइड बाय स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ फिफ्टी प्लस स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ टेन डिवाइडेड बाय स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ फिफ्टी प्लस स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ टेन राइट Now, when we are multiplying this term, so we will get here. You can see square root of fifty plus square root of ten, square root of fifty plus square root of ten. So we can write this one is equal to square root of fifty plus square root of ten, whole square, because this is two times divided by square root of fifty minus square root of ten, square root of fifty plus square root of ten. So a minus b, a plus b. so we know the formula of a minus b a plus b is equal to a square minus b square a square is here a is uh, square root of 50 and b is square root of 10 so it will become square root of 50 it is a so a square minus b square b is square root of minus 10 whole square right now here a plus b whole square so a plus b Whole square is equal to we know that a square plus b square plus two times ab. Now using this formula here we can write is equal to square root of fifty whole square a square plus b square b is square root of ten so square root of ten whole square plus two times square root of fifty times square root of ten divided by a square minus b square. So it will become here a plus b a minus b. So here uh, you can uh, cancel this one, right? Square is cancelled from square root. Square is cancelled from square root. So it will become here fifty minus ten. So fifty minus ten now is equal to square is cancelled from square root here also. Same way, so it will become here fifty plus ten plus two times. Now it will become here fifty times two times. Fifty into ten divided by fifty minus ten is forty. Now is equal to fifty plus ten is sixty plus two times. Now it will become here five hundred divided by forty. Now this five hundred we can write sixty plus two times. This five hundred we can write two times two times five. Times five times five, right? Divided by forty. This is factor of this five hundred. So equal to we can write this one sixty plus two. Now square root of two times square root of so uh, two. So we can write this one two times square root of four. This one two two is a four. Five five is a twenty five times square root of twenty five times square root of five. Divided by Forty is equal to sixty plus two times the square root of four is two times the square root of twenty five is five square root of five divided by forty is equal to now sixty plus two two is a four or uh, you can say five uh, two is a ten ten and two so it will become here twenty ten two is a twenty so twenty square root of five divided by Forty. Now here, sixty plus twenty square root of five divided by forty. So we can take common for uh, twenty here. So is equal to when we are taking common twenty. So twenty three is a sixty twenty one is a twenty one square root of five divided by forty. So twenty two is a forty. So we can write this one value of this is three. Plus one square root of five. That is square root of five. Three plus square root of five divided by two. This is the solution for this. So we can say square root of fifty plus square root of ten divided by square root of fifty minus square root of ten is equal to three plus square root of five divided by two. This is first method. Now we can solve this one from second method. 
so you can see your second method second method so here question is square root of 50 plus square root of 10 divided by square root of 50 minus square root of 10 this is question now we can we have to solve this from second method so this is 50 so this 50 we can write 10 times 5 5 tens are 50 plus square root of 10 divided by same here 10 times 5 minus square root of 10 now we can separate this term so square root of 10 times square root of 5 plus square root of 10 divided by square root of 10 times square root of 5 minus square root of 10 now we can take here common square root of 10 so we are taking square root of 10 common so left term that is 5 plus 1 right square root of 5 square root of 5 plus 1 and in denominator we are taking same square root of 10 common so square root of 5 minus 1 now square root of 10 is cancelled from square root of 10 so here we get the value uh, we got the value this is square root of 5 plus 1 divided by square root of 5 minus 1 now we can multiply here with uh, numerator and denominator by square root of 5 plus 1 square root of 5 plus 1 right so it will become here square root of 5 plus 1 square root of 5 plus 1 so here it will become square root of 5 plus 1 whole square because this is two times and in denominator it will become square root of 5 minus 1 square root of 5 plus 1 so a minus b a plus b that is a square minus b square so a is square root of 5 so it will become here square root of 5 that is a square minus b square b is 1 so 1 square this is the a plus b whole square formula so we know the formula a plus b whole square is equal to a square plus b square plus 2 times a b so using this formula here we can write this one is equal to square root of 5 a square plus b square b is 1 so 1 square plus 2 times a is square root of 5 times 1 divided by square root of 5 so square is cancelled from here square root and here 1 square that is 1 so 5 minus 1 so is equal to now here is square root of 5 and this is square so square is cancelled from square root so 5 plus 1 square is 1 plus 2 times square root of 5 divided by 5 minus 1 is 4 is equal to 5 plus 1 is 6 plus 2 square root of 5 divided by 4 now we can take common here 2 so we are taking common 2 2 3 is a 6 plus square root of 5 divided by 4 now 2 2 is a 4 so we got the value of this 3 plus square root of 5 divided by 2 this is the value for this question so we can say square root of 50 plus square root of 10 divided by square root of 50 minus square root of 10 is equal to 3 plus square root of 5 divided by 2 we got the same value in both method this is the solution for this question thank you